Toronto. He is the hero of this history. He's George Shalalo. He would not swallow all of the punch you in the for lunch. Round one. Now George Shavala was a hell of a man And he paid his way with his boxing hands Twice he fought Muhammad Ali George had followed the Canadian dream He would always hit him with a left, right, and left Round two It was six to six and I remember the day When George Shavala thought the cash is clear When the bout was done the two stood standing While the judges judged the fans kept chanting He would always hit him with a left, right, and left Chavalo, he's from Toronto, he is the hero of this history. He's George Chavalo, he would not swallow all of the punch that made for lunch. Round three. Judge gave it to Clay, but he was sent to the dock while George C. took his wife for a walk. Took her out dancing so full of love. George Chavalo was the man with the glove. He would always hit him on the left round. Four. It was 72, a rematch was made. Pacific Coliseum, George Clay. They went the distance, yet one more toss. George just said it and the other one asked. He went over there with a left, right, left. Meet George Chavano, he's from Toronto. He is the hero of the story. He's George Chavano, he would not swallow. All of the punch out of me for the love. Round five. Well, a few years passed and George would retire, but life's heard a different punch to this fight. He put up his dues and said, good lord, I'm ready. Georgia punched through all the gray. He went over there with a left, right, left. Round six. It was 85 when they heard the first shot. They were buried Jesse, Georgia's first son. Two to die, the Chavalos cried. Halloween brings suicide. He went over there with a left, right, left. Big Joe Chavalo, he's from Toronto. Son that they like to call Lee They found him dead in room 93 A needle in his arm and they wanted to die And meet with his brother Jess in the sky They were all dead about that left, right, left Meet George Chavalo, he's from Toronto He is the hero of the story Meet George Chavalo, he would not swallow Out of the punch they made for lunch Round nine But Two days after they buried Lee George had fallen, cried to his knees to find his wife Lynn dead She had taken some pills and died in Lee's bed He would always hit her with a left, right, left Round 10 The judge kept standing through all the gloom And his son, son Stephen would kill himself soon He had the guts to keep on standing In the fight against drugs There's no better man He would always hit her with a left, right, left.